Cheeksters! Hi YouTube! Hope your day is going well. Like the title says, today's video is a haul video. Based on your feedback, it seems to me that you guys like it when I share my fashion finds. And today's video is in partnership with Walmart. I don't know about you guys, but I really feel like Walmart right now, they're not coming to play, okay? I found some goodies that I cannot wait to share with you guys. I'm also going to be trying them on and reviewing them and of course styling the pieces for you so that you have outfit ideas as well. So if you're excited for this, make sure to hit that like button. It lets me know that you like these type of videos so I can make more. Also, if you're new here, my name is Chi Chi and I cover fashion, beauty, and a lifestyle. So if that's the kind of stuff you're into, then sis, you found your tribe. Get comfortable. All right, so y'all, you guys know how much I love my two-piece sets. And this one, to me, really ticks all the boxes as, as we go into winter. I love the fact that it has a high neck. It's a, it's a lightweight knit, so it's not too heavy. If you're somebody who gets easily warmed, yes, this is not too heavy. And for me, what really separates this out of all the two-piece sort of like sweater sets that I'm seeing a lot of out right now is the fact that this actually has pockets uh, oh my god also for my more petite girls I really like the length on this one it's not too long so this is great for lounging like you won't feel like you're you know like it's dragging on the floor um, because that is also something that I've seen with sets just like this if you're on a taller size I'm 5'7 this is definitely more of a crop on you this is something that is perfect if you're still working from home to do your zoom meetings but if you have to pick up your driver order you can easily just throw on some shirling boots and be out the door now i believe i got both the top and the bottom in an extra extra large which is my typical size at walmart but make sure to check the description box down below to see my exact size also i had somebody ask me what the description box was underneath the title of this video if you are watching this on mobile you will see a tiny little arrow and all you have to do is just click it and you will it'll drop down and you will see all of the information that i'm talking about in that box and everything typically is clickable so you can click and it'll take you exactly what you're looking for so let me know your thoughts on this two-piece lounge set is she a keeper yes no um and are you as obsessed as i am okay with these lounge wear sets i'm telling y'all these things come in clutch one sunday i had to go to the earlier service and i threw on a lounge wear set just like this um and i've gotten compliments on my neighbor um my group leader church these sets they really come in handy, okay? So again, I will link it for you in the description box. All right, y'all, so should we, do you want the good news or do you want the bad news? <laughs> Let's start with the bad news. These did go up my thighs, um, but it's gonna be, whew, it's gonna be some work, okay? I am able to button, I am able to zip, <sighs> okay. I have been recommending straight leg jean options. As you can see, it opened all by itself, okay? <laughs> um, because, you know, we're trying to move slowly away from the skinny, all right? However, the only exception I make for skinny jeans is because I like to wear combat boots. And you can't really, I mean, you can do a wide or straight leg jean with combat boots, but I just like the sleek look you get with skinnies and combat boots, right? Or if you wanna tuck in and wear like an over the knee boot or a knee high boot, you need some skinny jeans. So I wanted to try out these from Free Assembly and as you can see, it's, <laughs> I'm gonna need to size up. The BLT region is definitely the area that I always have to factor in when I'm shopping. So am I super surprised? No, I think these are size 20, but don't quote me on them. So if you're thinking of getting these, because I do like the stretch it has. It has stretch, but it's not too stretchy, so it'll help keep everything, you know, nice and, and controlled. I love the fact that it's black on black everywhere i always look for that detail in jeans also if you're a taller girl i'm 5'7 there is some fabric on the bottom which means 
if you're like 5, 8, 9, 10, maybe even 11, these will actually be long enough for you. Does it button? Yes, but my biggest issue is right here, okay? You know that little bitty bitty of fat right there? You know, she ain't coming over. You know, she's struggling in that area. So if you like a really, really snug fit, go ahead. But I prefer my jeans to be have a little bit more room in them. Like I said, this thing will snatch you. Okay, it is a good, good weight. Anyway, let me know in the comments below if I'm being extra. <laughs> Do I need to size up in these? I, I feel like I know the answer to that question. But let me know your thoughts on this one in the comments down below. So sweater dresses are a closet staple hashtag must have for the fall and winter. And if you do not have a nice collection of them, then consider adding this one to your collection. I love this kind of khaki army green color because it's it's a color, but it's also kind of like a neutral. I have it kind of like cropped. Let's put it this way. It is more of a longer length sweater. So if you prefer it to be longer, I just want to show you that it hits me around knee length. And if you are petite, it'll probably hit you more like a midi dress. I like that it's loose around the midsection, so it's not highlighting that area, but you could totally put a belt in it and crop it and make it shorter. So I love the versatility of this. I typically pair my sweater dresses with boots um, and then just throw on a cute little bag and you are good to go. As far as sizing, I believe I got this in an extra extra large, but again, check the description box to be sure. It's a lightweight knit, so if you're someone who gets warmed up really easily, you won't overheat in this. That's what I love about it. So I like that it's the perfect weight for layering. All the cute little details around the cuff and around the neckline. I like that it's a v-neck. You know, for my bustier girls I would recommend this over something with a higher neck because I find like higher necks tend to you know emphasize the <laughs> size of the bust overall I would give this sweater dress an 8 out of a 10 I haven't washed it but I love how soft it is I love that it's cut in a very flattering manner so let me know in the comments below if she, should I keep her should I return her what are your thoughts on this dress it is coat season and one of my biggest hacks when it comes to dressing in the fall and winter is really to add great coats to your wardrobe it's the first thing that people see okay when they meet you and you could have literally your oldest crustiest pajamas underneath okay but if you have a great nice structured coat it's done all the work for you so Let's talk about this coat. I love that it has a wide lapel. It also has buttons on either side going down. I love that it's structured and it's affordable, okay? Coats can get really expensive and I love that this coat has all of the trimmings. So I don't have anything this color. So I was like, you know what, let me see her. I love that she has pockets. The pockets are stitched down, but it's as easy as just taking the stitches off. It is gathering season. And if you are looking for a coat to help smarten up your looks for, you know, Friendsgiving or a holiday party, then look no further. Okay, she will be linked in the description box down below. All right, so I just wanted to point out that Free Assembly has a nice selection of basics. Another wardrobe must have that I saw that I had to share with you guys. They have these high neck ribbed turtlenecks in a bunch of um, solid colors and I think they have it in another striped um, print as well. I like again the weight of these. These are the perfect weight for layering. I am very weird when it comes to like turtlenecks. For one, I don't know if my neck is really small but I find that the necks on a lot of turtlenecks are always too big for me. Fabric is also light enough that I don't feel super constricted in this. It's just like the perfect weight for you to throw on a cardigan, a jacket, 
and to even layer underneath it as well if you were thinking of doing that as temps dip. As far as lengthwise, you get a lot of length for my tall girls. You can't ever have too many turtlenecks, especially in the fall and winter. And I love the fact that this is an unbasic basic. So I'm gonna go ahead and link this stripe ribbed combo in the description box for you as well. So let's talk about this sweater dress. If you like cozy, chunky knits, this is one for you, okay? Um, I love the collar detail, the turtleneck, it's very chunky. I love the pleating detail happening on the sleeves. Adds something and kind of elevates the dress. Also, the color is perfect for the season. Overall, I really like the silhouette. It's not too tight anywhere. It kind of like skims over the body. I feel like the style is um, universal enough that it will look great whether you carry weight around your midsection whether you have like more slender hips it'll fit more like boxy and if you are more pear shaped I really feel like free assembly aka Walmart nailed the length and the fit on this one all right so if you have been looking for a shacket look no further because I got this one for you now I have a, a little bit of a collection of shackets, but I have been on the hunt for a long time for just a simple standard black and white and this is it. I love the fact that this kind of like tapers around the wrist. The length also isn't too long and it's not too short. It's also not too oversized. I know somebody sent me a DM saying how much they love shackets, but every time they put it on they're like a bear. Well this if you get your true size, will fit a lot closer to the body. It also has a nice weight right now. As we're going into the cooler temps, this will take you into that time. You can also pair it with like a turtleneck for additional warmth. So I like the fact that it's easy to layer. You can also layer a heavier coat on top. Um, it has curves on the side and it's kind of like a high-low hem, okay? I love curves, especially for my girls with wider hips. And then the high-low hem means that if you want to wear it with leggings, it will cover your butt. I feel like they really put a lot of thought in the construction of this. It has real pockets in the front. It buttons all the way down. And for me, it's the versatility, okay? The color means you can wear this with literally so much more in your wardrobe. If you want to go with a bold color underneath, you can do that. If you want to keep things neutral, you can do that. We wear a lot of black in the fall and winter, so it'll go with all of your black looks, leather pants, jeans. I'm just going to link her for you in the description box down below because if you have been looking for a jacket, girl, girl, get her before she sells out. That's all I'm going to say. Another closet must have this time of year is a great bodysuit and I was able to grab this bodysuit. I love things like this to pair with skirts, with jeans, with sweatpants and just throw on a chunky sweater. It's such an easy thing and I just feel like you can never have enough of this. In my wardrobe checklist I definitely discuss the importance of having basics. This is one basic that will pay for itself over and over again. This is a unique neck bodysuit it does have snaps but I actually just prefer to wear it like a leotard let me know in the comments below if you actually snap your bodysuits or if you just put your body in it and the neck is stretchy enough that you can do that it is a wide neck and it goes past even the widest parts of my body what I like about this bodysuit specifically is the weight of it it's not too heavy it's not too light it does have some stretch to it and some slight ribbing as well very comfortable so I highly recommend if you do not have a nice selection of bodysuits like this to grab one now. I would grab at least two um, and it also comes in black as well and like I said it's just one of those basics that you can wear so many different ways. 
So I know you guys have been asking me to share more workwear pieces. Well, this is one item that I feel like would work for work and weekend. You could easily wear a skirt like this to church. It is a lightweight knit skirt. I like that it has a thick waistband. It is high-waisted and it's an A-line. And A-lines tend to be flattering on most body shapes. Pair this with a pair of pumps or when things get cooler, you could also do like an over-the-knee boot quality wise I give this an 8 out of a 10. It has some great stretch to it so if you're in between sizes you can play around with the fit on this one. So if you saw my last Walmart video you know I was talking about how I love jumpsuits for this time of year. I mean it's just like a one and done outfit you know so when I saw this jumpsuit on the website I jumped on it what I like is that it's it has a zipper in the back so it's just easy for you to step into um, and I'm wearing it here in a size extra large it has pockets this fabric is kind of like a stretch crepe type fabric so very forgiving as you can see it does have some stretch to it and then of course it's a wide leg style and then it has this belt that you can use to kind of like cinch in your waist and give yourself some good shape why am i feeling very scooby-doo <laughs> in this look but I'm not actually mad at it so she fits really well up top and honestly I'm not mad at the fit on the bottom I am wearing her here in a size extra large and I'm typically not an extra large I'm more of an extra extra large so I would say she runs a little bit big however I feel like maybe if I sized up um, I feel like it would hang a little bit more loose around the BLT area, which is what I typically prefer. Let me know in the comments below if you think I should size up for her or not. Because I'm not actually not sure. Like, I feel like if I size up, because you know, like, when I do this, you can kind of see some of this um, puckering right here. And I feel like if I sized up, I wouldn't see that puckering anymore. So let me know what you think. Should I size up or keep her the size that I have right now? This is what she fits like all around, like so. Let me know your thoughts. Also, let me know what shoes you would pair with this. Would you do black? Would that be too of a too much of a contrast? Or would you do brown? Okay, I actually have a pair of like my pumpkin colored boots, but I feel like that might be like too much orange. As far as length for my taller girls, this hits me right around the ankle and I'm 5'7", so if you're taller than me, it's gonna be a little bit more cropped on you, which actually still works with this wide leg shape. And for my more petite girls, if you're like 5'5 five five and under, it'll be like a nice wide leg style on you. We wear this to like, you know, a uh a Christmas party or even Christmas dinner because it does have a lot of stretch and of course you can loosen the belt to give yourself even more room around the belly. Let me know your thoughts about her in the comments. So I did something a little bit different in this video with the setup. Let me know if you like it the way I did it in this video or if you prefer for me to go back to the old ways of sitting and talking on the side. I would love to know your thoughts. When I'm not on YouTube, you can always find me um, on Instagram where I share daily-ish fashion and style inspo as well. Okay, and I feel like IG sometimes gets the scoop first just because it's so much easier for me to jump on stories so make sure you're following there because I also share like different ways to style pieces etc etc to get a hold of me super quick because maybe you're about to check out and you're worried about sizing you can always slide in my dm I typically check it in real time and if you ever want to know the tea on any featured items, maybe I forgot to include it in the description box down below, make sure to just click the shop my outfits link or shop my looks link in the description. It will take you to my like to know it page. And sis, if you have not downloaded the like to know it app, girl, stop it and download it there. Not only do I link almost everything that I featured on that app, 
all of your favorite influencers are on that app too and they do the same and they now have a new feature where you can actually save an item that you're interested in and it will alert you when that item goes on sale okay if you enjoy this video you found a couple of pieces that you bought the cop and you want more videos just like this all you have to do is subscribe now if I did mention it already my jeans from Walmart literally this is a cult favorite jacket from Walmart and if you have not checked out the free assembly line on Walmart definitely check it out peruse honestly it is the quality and the great selection of basics for me okay and they also do some really nice standout pieces I will link to this outfit and of course everything that I mentioned and featured in this video in the description box down below for you special thanks to Walmart for sponsoring this video it really means the world to me when you guys support brands that support our community in this channel and keep us thriving so thank you um don't forget to rate comment subscribe and share and until next time babes stay blessed